As we build more models and go back, modify, and make changes, we even really notice inside of our timeline that there are yellow and red highlights over some of our features. When we see a yellow highlight, that tells us that our geometry is missing our reference. However, it can use the cache data to still build that feature. When we see a red highlight, that tells us that our geometry is missing a reference. However, it no longer can compute or create that feature. In this case, I'm going to make some simple geometry and planes with sketches that are based off that geometry. When I go back and make changes, we can see how features can miss those references since they are no longer there. I also want to show you how to change our model and go back and fix those. In this case, I simply have a cut for an extruded feature, and I want to finish it off with some rounded fillet edges. Once my design is complete, let's give an example of going back and in this case I'm going to delete my sketch. When I go in and I delete my sketch, the extrude that I originally created for my box shape is missing that reference geometry. We can see in my timeline that that feature is now highlighted. To fix this, I can roll my timeline back to before the feature. It's important to go before the feature when you create a new sketch. This way, when I create, in this case, my ellipse, my feature can reference it since it's before it inside the timeline. Now, I created a different shape than the original to show the example of when I update how my other features are affected. By right-clicking and editing my feature, I can select my new geometry for my sketch. We'll notice that my other geometry that I have here, such as my plane, is now missing its reference. I can simply redefine that reference with one of my origin planes so that my sketch geometry, which is the cut, has a new plane in which to cut. So once my plane is fixed, we'll see that my hole is again inside my feature. Switching from a square to an ellipse, I am missing my edges I had before. I simply go in, edit that fillet feature, select a new edge, and I have resolved my red and my yellow highlighted errors.